Hi folks. In this video we're going to play around with uh, more thin films. And this time though we're going to use this uh, piece of wax paper that I soaked in borax the last time. And uh, we're going to coat it with uh, cellulose acetate on either side. And, uh, and then see how that performs in a battery. So I've got a few drops on there. Spread it around good. Give that just a second to dry up. I can see it drying in front of my eyes. Blow on it just a bit. Alright. The surface is pretty dry already. Alright, let's flip it over and do the other side. I like how quick this stuff is. I'm not going to lick my finger this time either. <laughs> acetate in my mouth. Borax though is actually uh, good for you. Athletes are using it to uh, enhance their performance these days. Alright, so now we've got that paper ready. That'll make a couple of separators. Now this next one, we're going to try something a little different here. I've got another piece of the wax paper that borax in it. and But this time uh, we're going to try to make a thicker uh, thin film and we're going to incorporate uh, some titanium dioxide and graphite in it. I've got an equal amounts of those approximately in this cup here. Shake it around there and mix them up a little bit. And then we're going to add some cellulose acetate to that and then paint that on one side let it dry and then uh, soak in water and hopefully pull a, fil a film off of it that we can take them and just throw between two electrodes and should produce a battery another way. So how many how many ways can we build a biocell? Alright. So let's put some uh, acetate in there. That'll put enough in there to make it fairly liquid. Try that. Mix it up here. Pretty gray color. It's setting up already. And borax. Hell of a linking aid. this works so I'll set up the system where I can just get the right consistency of it, paint it on something and then lift it off and make a bunch of these at one time. Alright so we'll we'll give this a, a whirl here and uh, we'll try it in a 
future experiment. Alright, thanks for watching.